Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky makes an urgent video plea to Congress as he pleads with U.S. lawmakers to do more to help his war-torn nation as Russia continues its relentless attacks on Ukraine. Fox's Lauren Blanchard is in Poland with the details. Ukraine's president making a direct plea to Congress and President Biden for more support. We are fighting for the values of Europe and the world, sacrificing our lives in the name of the future. A desperate plea from Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky during a historic virtual address to Congress. Recalling Pearl Harbor and 9-11, Zelensky implored lawmakers to help the people of Ukraine and stop the Russian invasion by providing more weapons, more fighter jets, and implementing a no-fly zone. President Zelensky then addressing President Biden directly. I'm addressing the President Biden. You are the leader of the nation, of your great nation. I wish you to be the leader of the world. Being the leader of the world means to be the leader of peace. President Biden remains opposed to a no-fly zone and fighter jets, but is offering another $800 million in military funding. Still, Russian troops continue their relentless attacks, much of the violence targeting civilians. We don't have any military targets here. It's just a residential area. Meanwhile, more than three million refugees have escaped the war-torn country, some now returning to Ukraine and joining the fight. My sons didn't want me to go back, but I'm determined. I'm sure Putin won't wait for me with flowers. As peace talks continue, President Zelensky said Russia's demands for ending the war are becoming more realistic. In Poland, Lauren Blanchard, Fox News.